there's Takedo again, flying out, rifle in hand, catches one, two, three. Oh, oh no! no. Vince is right on the top leg. And there's a double kill that comes in from Cozy to get to the EMP inside. Oh, he's trying to shoot him. Oh my god! No! Pass by! Four, three, one! Get ready, grip. Welcome in, ladies and gentlemen. A bit of a uh, a weird start so far to the cast. Um, been a few technical issues regarding the new update coming out recently, but we are now straight into the action, into the first one. It's going to be Hook 2.0. Kind of a nice surprise to see it all kind of kick off. It is going to be exciting. Tonight we have newbies versus Short. A bit of a uh, issue right now regarding a fourth or fifth in from Short. But hopefully I can join in for the next few rounds. I'm going to be joined by 24 grade, the man, the myth, the legend. How are you doing for this cast tonight, Gray? Feeling good. It's good to get back on onward. And it was a bit of an abrupt start, but, you know, There's somebody Hook, the, uh, <laughs> one of my favorite maps to guys. start off right on, a, on a 5 3 free situation. Not the best for Schult, but again, this whole season, but fine shot. Ooh. Okay. Oh, it's going to be caught this here. Oh, this is looking very bad. Oh, oh unfortunately, gets taken out by Sophie and Boredom. How did I miss the confirm? What is wrong? I've also just realized if a player syringes himself now, you, you get a Q, which is uh, kind of cool. The new flashback oh. coming out. Oh, Sophie. There's one behind the other one. I was an M23 smoke. Sophie does appear to be trying to go for a cap. Smokes and flashes are coming out. There is a hole though. They're going to get taken out. Nactum is watching. He's going to be taken out boredom. Finds one. It's a second one to Sophie. Double kill. Can he get a third? Down goes Shrimp by Mikkel. It is now down. Special Ops flanks around. Does take out Nactum. Does Michael aware of this? He's not. Michael's aware of that. He's going for the life! And he gets it! <laughs> the first round for newbies by Special Ops with the knife kill. Turn it off clean. Wow. Oh, turn, but... it, turn it close, Glue. A 5v3 situation. <laughs> it's gotten it very, very wow. close, sir. <laughs> oh Definitely my. We'll be celebrating that, but I mean, a win's a win. Getting a point on the board on my socks always. The good thing, Mantis hopping in for a Schult on a 4v5. Now, let's see if Schult can bring it back, being down from the start. So it's uh, definitely nice to see when I finally have their fourth in. Bit of a very quick start, I did say. He had been waiting for quite a while. Please do excuse any of the technical problems and issues whilst on the cast. Uh, it's been a while since it's all been set up and due to the custom map tourney, a lot of the casting stuff haven't been uh, you know, set up and such, so we won't actually be able to set up the team, you know, the uh, the maps we are playing, but just know it is going to be Hook 2.0 for the first map, and we just have to uh, use our imagination <laughs> for what the other <laughs> maps will be, but we will uh, see how that goes as we get back into the second round. So particularly for this objective, the northeast is you can spawn in three different locations. One on the southeast, the spawn that Shull have just gotten now, and when you be spawned the round before, and it does tailor towards a different push. Obviously, newbies got a, a some would say a good spawn, an aggressive spawn, which can cut off the majority of the push towards the west. We see Sophie and Special Ops doing now, but th there's not really much coverage. From the, from the spawn of Schult and it just allowed newbies to get in many many obscure positions as you just saw Special Ops finds Michael on the refrag. Oh, Mantis what's Mantis doing? Here. Oh, what's the plan here? Man, it's going for it. Goes for the swing, swings the corner. Oh, it doesn't see. And Sophie takes out Mantis with a sneak attack. Down to a four versus two. Not a good look so far for Schultz. I need to try to pull it back here. Nactum and Bottom now kind of pushing away through the center section. 
Gonna be spotted by Bonham here if he's not careful. Oh, shots are coming out. Oh no, Nightingale gets taken out by Boredom. Down to a one versus four. It's only down to, could still be revived, but very unlikely in his situation where he is now. Well, could rotate freely here. Gotta watch out for shot and dead's crossfire, but it is a fairly free rotate if shot's not wary. Gotta be really careful in this cross though. Barely covered by the palm tree. If he does get this res, they know where boredom is, and that's one of the one of the four pickings that they need. Maybe button goes for the pick before even even getting knocked get him up me. because currently the the defense is quite spread out. It's gonna be uh <laughs> Button seems a little bit lost. The beauty of, what of no do. one knowing this map. <laughs> that is going to be uh, the small problem of this. Everyone, of course, isn't going to have that experience like all the other maps. So it's going to see how these teams are going to be able to adapt. You know, with two minutes and 40 seconds remaining, there is still plenty of time to identify and establish different attacking routes. But currently, Button is just trying to go for that revive. It does need to be very, very quick or else, you know, Nactum could bleed out here. It's always the case of, how do I get up there, or how do I get round to you? Especially when you're down, you don't have your tablet at hand. You've got to pay a mental picture for your <laughs> your teammates to get that res. This res should be coming out by boredom. Making it a 2v4 situation here. Two minutes remaining. Nocton going to find that kill? Oh, tried it a second time, but not to any regards. Killed by Boredom yet again. Now down to a 1 versus 4. Button is making lots of audio. Short will be able to hear this. That's communicated that end. Do they have a, an accurate echo here? Could possibly, but I imagine they would be aware of the fact that it is only a 1v4. We'll say 1v4. An echo for oh the name from boredom takes it out and that is the first second round i should say not the first round second round to newbies but we do switch objective and particularly this objective does tailor a vault sided or, or a defense so if shock can hold this and then take their masoc it could could even out this objective is quite particular in that you can cap from the outside and inside of the objective it, just put down camera two you can cap from camera two in that corner there but also cap on the top floor so if you do make it in successfully then you have many opportunities and the volk really do need to clear all aspects of the building both outside and in it's somewhat in a courtyard and if you can cut off the the entry of well, all, all the cracks in the wall it, it does tailor a vault defense but we'll see if Schult can hold it I mean for this map in particular I would say you're kind of the expert towards it from your <laughs> from your long list of experience which you have definitely talked about way too many times to me but <laughs> you know you, you know this map you know how it plays you know all the ins and outs and all the little you know special little nooks and crannies so get that additional advantage where, where would you imagine that short should be putting themselves to have the best chance of trying to get their first point in this map so for sure you you do need someone guarding the north but it's often a, a hard push and seeing where newbies have spawned again there's three possible spawns for this one in the south one in the middle and then one in the north this gives them opportunity for early lines cutting people off pushing the middle black hut. Unfortunately, no one's going to go for that. And as we said, Shelter opting for a very, very mess slash tucked in defense. Not to going for the center route. And this could be powerful. Newbie's attacking north. And if Nocton can get on the third story here, we'll cut off all of that push. In a powerful position, no matter what, really. No one's going to expect him here. Is he going to look at the right time? 
I saw movement north, north. They are coming. I will come behind them, maybe. He, he does radio it out. North, north. And, and this is a wrong approach by newbies, in my opinion. <laughs> Attacking through the north is, is going to be detrimental. You can't easily push through <laughs> the archway. Oh, Dying was boarding from Mantis. Uh, minus one center. I was really expecting the first kill to go to Button there, as he's on that top section. But we see, oh. if in the disc, Nactum! Nactum going for the flank! Come on, Nactum! Yeah. <laughs> Nactum acting as part of the Marsoc team here. Is wow. he going to be able to push on it though? That's the question. The, the issue is now, is he going to make too much order and get himself pincered? Well, he's locked off what he needs to. It's just if Special and Sophie actually hear him. The audio awareness, guys. Can they... <sighs> Nocturne is being pretty... Pretty savory now. Special and Sophie have heard that call out by Noctum. Oh no. And they've heard each other here. Noctum's not gonna be looking at this. And oh, down goes yeah. Noctum. Oh, that's definitely gonna hurt. But look at if we move over back to Mitchell. Gonna it's gonna be. Oh. Standing in the open in front of the cave, that is a risky move there. The rotate just in time. People talk about onward timing and it's definitely a real thing. <laughs> How often it happens. That they're, they're just not covering the south, which I feel like they've got a bit siloed now onto the northern approach. And this could this could really hurt the shell defense. They they've left the hole. Oh, and Michael's gonna push this, not realizing that Shrimple, Stiltskin, and Shaw and Dead are trained on his position here. Oh yeah, the awareness, just the general yeah, awareness of the one. map. And they're they're just getting too aggressive. They need to slow down, Shell need to realize that newbies have to come to them they're already on a man disadvantage here with a 4v5 situation the objective is relatively open here glue i mean yes the only access to the building is on the north and the south but sorry the north and the the west but newbies can kill button mantis has got a lot of ground to cover Oh, but Mantis gets a pick onto Shot and Dead. Is he going to swing and get Shrimp as well? Oh. The timing on that. But, oh no. Did he see it? Oh, Mantis getting taken out by Shrimp. Overexposes himself. Down to a one. Oh yeah, I just realized the buggy which you yeah. mentioned. You got the revives come up when you use syringes. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, there goes one. Oh, is that going to be a flash? Is that a nade? Oh, that's a flash. That was an amazing flash as well. Special trying to find his way into the building. This is going to be a cap here. That is coming out. Blood's not where. But special the cap. Oh, no, he gets the cap, I think. No, no, get the kill, get the kill. Yes, yes. I was going to say, special can't cap that quickly. <laughs> <laughs> But I lose my mind. Like, when did special could cap in one second? <laughs> Anything can happen if you believe enough. I believe in magic. Come on, Shul. I want you to win this attack now because I want to see my favorite objective in the southeast. The southeast is just the pinnacle of vault defenses. Throwback to boss fight, season twelve on hook. The pinnacle of uh, hook players. Yeah, Even like you I and the uh... Vikings in the <laughs> semi-finals. You, you say you say <laughs> you, you say you and you hook players. You mean like you and the uh, the one other person in the world, which actually uh, <laughs> who knows everything yeah. about this map. I, I say that knowing well that half we the lost. people we don't even know what hook is. <laughs> <laughs> well, we lost hook against Vikings in the in the semi-finals. 
<laughs> so didn't we lose they, they, hook point two point oh against friendly fire recently? I swear we did. We don't talk about that. Yeah, we did, didn't we? Yeah, we. <laughs> the the first time we play hook two point oh as a team, we lose it to friendly fire. <laughs> I mean, that, we beat them on the other maps, the but like, <laughs> <laughs> that was the uh, the one thing to which you cry about every single night, thinking about. We see Schult here have got the summon spawn out of the three, and this could tailor towards a cave push. They do have the advantage, unfortunately not. <laughs> I think they've got their northern styles mixed up here. Look at this extension by Sophie and Sean Dead here. This is this is powerful and knowing that they're only against four Marsac players, you can lose one, but if they take two people out you're in an, an immediate advantage, even more so on a vault defense. So shot with the early shots here finds Michael. Oh man, he could get the res here. Oh was it really necessary for the C4? Like a very inappropriate use of a C4, I'll be honest. <laughs> <laughs> Another revive, which surprisingly was an actual revive for a change. A smoke. It's a shame that we can't uh, we can't experience the new flashes in, in spectator mode. So as if you want to be flashbanged. Yeah, it's new, right? I always like new things. Do you new really though? Shots coming out I mean, from what's Mantis. Our approach here. I don't really know. That that Mrs. Sophie. Oof. What angle is this? This map is interesting to say at least. I just don't trust myself because I know I'd probably accidentally fall off on the buildings. <laughs> so we getting over Peaky here. It's just you know. Oh, but man just gets it. Oh, talk about a kill. A I would have not been looking up there for anybody. It's looking good for Shaw here in a 3v4 situation. Shaw is nowhere near the objective and they're playing a similar defense as to what they played in the previous round. Shaw finds Michael on the same angle. <laughs> Both find the refrag. <laughs> oh, look at Mantis. Oh, down goes short and button with a trade. And this is interesting. Now, what do you do? Do you go for the. You revive definitely or... go for the revive, yes. With two minutes remaining, it's. Yeah, you're cutting it close. I mean, knowing Mantis's position here, he's the last guy and they don't reliably have a good echo. They killed one sure, but does Button know that he traded out? And I think he'll die on Schultz, uh, Shrimple's crossline here. He may be able to get this cross safe, so I don't think Shrimp's watching at the moment. He's going the long way around. He's got to run across that catwalk here. One minute twenty remaining. Not even he knows where he's going. <laughs> the power of the wit and the power of the brave. Bottoms rotated into a decent position. I so. forgot there was water sounds in this game. <laughs> as weird as it sounds, I forget that. <laughs> it's been so, you. You hardly ever walk in water in this game, so I completely forgot there was actually water sounds. Fifty seconds remaining. They've got a rush. This is going to um, be very, very tight if they want to try to get this. They do only have 40 seconds. Right, let's push that west alleyway then. Let's go, boys. 
No time to waste. They're gonna hear these beep in five seconds and the immediate panic from Mantis and Button. Oh, the special ops, I see that. Oh, special ops does peek up and is gonna take out the double but gets traded out for the final round. 4 0 to newbies on the first map. Unfortunately, a lot of trades that I saw from from numerous rounds and again being on a man advantage it immediately favors the team with five players and to be fair newbies did play excellently and held their defenses tight but if Schultz didn't overextend especially with only having four players they could have come out on top at least one or two rounds I saw played it's not over though we've got two more maps in it I wonder what Let's the next maps one. are going to be though, because that was a newbie's pick. I wonder what the the next map is going to be, because like for me this is kind of like a um a random <laughs> a random mystery wheel of some sorts, because I've never actually uh, played half of these maps, so it's a learning experience. Maybe less for you, because you've uh, you've been here longer than I have. You've uh, uh you've I'm tasted wilding. you've tasted fine wine of the onward map selection mm. to say at least. <laughs> In in uh, in politically correct terms, he's calling me an old old sod. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm waiting for you to retire, my friend. Let the uh, yeah. let, <laughs> let 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 the new kids have a chance to uh, be the, on the top for a change. <laughs> well, my back hurts. My hair is grey. My knees are squeaking. Sounds like a regular day to me, to be honest. <laughs> oh, next map. I have uh, played this map once. <laughs> a total of one time. A total of one time. Hey, you're well actually looks Hey, hey, hey. Pretty you are you are welcome to sit there and to say random call outs to me and I just sit down and go, mm-hmm, yep, most definitely. I know exactly where that is. I've definitely heard of that before. Well, the middle building you've got the warehouse or and to to the right, like garage and then the mini bazaar or bazaar and then radio. I mean it has radio plastered on the side of it, so fountain top garage. Oh, you're no, boring me, Gray. <laughs> I make up call outs after that. I'm like, oh, there's a well over there. I'll call that well. <laughs> there oh, is there's a football pitch. <laughs> there's a well... building. It's a building. <laughs> that building That's looks slightly out. crooked. Crooked building. It, he's on the. We should start the, the bizarre call out here. He's on number two, 224 East Tower. Oh, please do not. <laughs> uh, that 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 even I'm lost to that East twenty four. What? <laughs> we don't even have a twenty four on East. What are you talking about, Gray? What we should do is just put individual house numbers on each of these buildings. <laughs> we we should uh we makers we <laughs> memorize it. We we should we should go to DPI and send them a message saying on every single building on Bazaar put like a house number. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, so now you've updated Bazaar. Can you can you actually give us the street names so <laughs> I can I can address my letters to my enemies? You can, uh, <laughs> wait, oh, I, why not? Why don't you just fuck it? Oh, so why don't you just uh, ship a nade over to an enemy? Why don't you, Gray? <laughs> Here's my invoice plus a C4. Enjoy. <laughs> just just see it. Just uh, send a nice little C4 through the mailbox, of course. <laughs> that is just what the people need. I forget how big this map is, though. So, did you ever play the original Sand? Or is this the only Sand you've ever seen? <sighs> you forget. I'm uh, I'm new to the world of Onwards. I am a baby okay. to the Onward scene, as you like to call it. So, if you zoom out of Sand, if I, you look at camera 2... No, not camera 2 again. <laughs> <laughs> You, you see the wall outside, so they were, you could never go outside of the wall, and the football pitch was no longer there, and all the, the connectors were also no longer there. 
So he was literally... Th think about it as an enclosed space of the four buildings plus the east and the west courtyard. And then obviously the north. But he added all these additions of new buildings. So none of the buildings were there either. Basically making it way more complex than Sand 1.0. Then again, you do have actual names if you look at camera three. There is a <laughs> shipyard that's 10,000 kilometers away. Oh, yeah. Is always. <laughs> always a good little Easter egg for the folks. I can't wait to go back to see shipyard. Anyway, back to the uh, actual gameplay, something which we're meant to be commentating. Oh, down goes Sophie already by Mantis. Shrimp is above. How did he even get up here? Down goes Baton UK. No refrag by Manius, unfortunately. Does he see the top of his head? He does. Ooh. Echo 2. Down goes Mantis. It's shut down. And they're nearly halfway onto objective here. They kill a shrimp here. What's stopping them? I mean, I guess short. Down goes Special Ops. Yeah. Shrimp's not looking for this. Are we gonna see a cap? No way. I'm calling it glue. No, I don't Jackson, believe. Jackson, get your tablet out. Michael, make some noise. This is a cap. Don't go up. Oh no. He doesn't realize. Oh, the opportunity. Oh, he gets one. Go for the cap, Nactum. And no rotate. No rotate by the newbies. Get shrimp. Go for the cap, Nactum. Oh no. You gotta come out of it in time. Mm. Oh, oh does my. I know there. Oh my, come on, Nactum. What a story. Nactum, you know where he is. You heard the footsteps. Who's gonna see who first? It's a game of mystery. Is yeah, Nactum gonna. He's back. Oh, come on, Nactum. Someone's got to make noise here, Glue. Come the on. First person to make noise. How do they not realize each other's Nocturne, positions? Nocturne seated. Nocturne Nocturne look to the left. Ten seconds. Come on, look to your left. Oh. He sees his head. No. No. Bottom. No. <laughs> Come on, guys. Oh, my. The suspense is killing me. Look down. <laughs> How? What is going on? Next to him, please just look down. No, oh my I I don't believe it. I do not believe Beyond it. With timing glue. I do not believe it. What's going to transpire here? Does Nocton push down? I mean, Bodum's got to cover a whole 360 degrees at this point. No way. Come on, Nactum. One slight audio move. Wait. But bottom Did here's you... that. You see his you, you see him tilt his head slightly? No. You see him. Wait, do you think that Nactum's gonna try to go for it? He's got a cap! He's, he's got a he's, cap! He's mate. going for it! He's he got is, a cap! He's going for he's it! He's going for it. it! Come on, Nactum! Oh. Rodham. Come on, oh Nectum! Come on, Nectum! No! He's way. going for it! Come on, Nectum! And I believe you can cap from here. Please. Please. He's typing it in! Please! Two. Oh, come on, Nectum! You need to get closer, Nectum! Nectum oh, sees but... him! Oh. And there we go! What I think happened was Nactum uh, saw him. Nactum saw him before, and that's why Nactum went for the tablet to then go for the cap. Oh I, think, my. I think Nactum did see him. 
Oh but my lord. I was I was I was not built for that level of emotional strain. Just waiting. I'm just like just begging for it. <laughs> I just what, wanted what to see it. Through boredom's head there. Like what, what just happened? I just got shot from somewhere where he couldn't possibly be. <laughs> that is oh my Wow. I mean, are you not able to cap from there then? I really thought you could. If you got a bit closer, so the objective is think of a semicircle dome. So you can, as you, the higher you get, the smaller the cap radius. But I reckon you could have capped right on top if he just poked his hand over. Anyhow, Schultz have one point on the board, their first point of the match, and Leander has found his way in, so we're in a 5v5 situation here. And Schultz have the defense. That is... Whew. That has to be... <laughs> I'm just emotionally recovering from the suspense. He was just... I just don't get it. I just don't know how that happens. <laughs> How does that happen where I mean, both players are stood right next to each other for so long and there's just no reaction, no like incentivization of anything? It's just like pure quiet. Well, it was zero audio made by both players, which made it so unknown to the both of them. You know, you don't know where the enemy is, and Nocton played that perfectly. The Newbie's also getting the quick spawn of the three. Might be able to catch some early lines. Not so I'm not gonna realize Sophie's pushing that. You can see an early pick here. Sophie misses! Oh luckily special was there for the refrag and 4v4 situation. He Fairly similar defense as to what the newbies displayed. Leander getting a bit peaky. He's got to be careful. We saw how that ended Ooh. last time. Borden with a headshot. The overexposure. And the cap's open again. Did the newbies learn from last time? I think or... Button is trying to... Rotate back to the OGJ here. This is a deadly cross and Mantis and Michael. Borden finds another headshot. What a monster. They're not ready for Michael here. Shot does hear him. Michael! No! Michael with the whiff! Oh, all eyes trained on Michael now. Why with the single fire? <laughs> What a chat. Makes it out of there alive. Not for long. The There's one. Is... one. But get taken out by shorts. <laughs> what was oh that? God. What was the single fire? <laughs> what a chad. Catches how many? Finds one. one with a single fire. Gets refragged. Don't get capped on button. Your sole purpose for the next three minutes <laughs> good job you have gone to do something gray which someone's mentioned in chat oh oh lord what do you think that could be gray <laughs> oh. your one job which you have except for making my life bearable but no a cab could come out here oh the team name's not displaying for you oh they're not oh yeah i forgot i didn't load in in time did i Oh, I do. Good refresh. Button just needs to die here. Shot on I the cap. I spelt short wrong, but I can't be asked to change it. But no, Button. Button's not aware. Button goes Sophie. But the cap comes out from short. And it is over. And oh my. I put the team wrong names wrong, the wrong way around. <laughs> ah, 
Can you do them? Because I don't I'm midway of doing this. I can't. I can't. I, I messed up short twice there. Don't, don't look at me for help. <laughs> but no, newbies with a two. Wow, oh, that's definitely going to set. I put the wrong things in, didn't I? I do need to fix this um, caster thing, though. A lot of my casting stuff is really broken, and I have no idea why. You're not supposed to say that. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Night Fire, but my package is a little bit broken. I'm not really exactly sure why. I haven't touched it. This isn't the package which I've touched. It was it was broken when I found it, I swear. <laughs> Says every child as they drop their parents' iPad. It was broken Whoa. when I found it. I swear. Hey, I hey, hey. Listen, listen. I have not the touched... I, <laughs> I, I have not touched the, the VML Onward caster package. I cast. I touched the veil one, but not the onward one. I'm not sure why the onward one's broken. I'll be perfectly honest. It was fine last season, but I Same just. Same. No, it, it should be fine, but the music's gone and everything about it's kind of messed up, and I'm not exactly sure why. I'm gonna have to reinstall it when I get back. I say get back right. as if I have anywhere important to go. <laughs> Schultz having the best spawn of the three, in my opinion. They can cut off a lot of early lines in the crosses to the south here. And Newbie's going to get caught off that. Schultz, an aggressive push on the south. Not taking any early lines, it looks like. And fairly spread defense once again. Probably the better position to wrap round to the football pitch. And encroach on the south. They can get the pick onto special, but... He's so tucked in in the radio. In the radio shack. <laughs> oh, Leander. That is a perfect response to how I feel when I played this map for the first time. <laughs> Where the blank am I? Nice kill from Mantis. Oh, special two and a lot of shots towards Mantis. Do take him out. Stan was an MP3 smoke from Leander. It's pushing. Where is he even? Down goes Borden from Michael. I'm so confused on where people are on the map. This is looking good for Shell. Maybe a team kill. I think but Button is. No, uh, oh, a nice little. Nice little <laughs> you're still <thing>. alive. <laughs> <laughs> Just whispers into your ear, you're still alive. <laughs> Whilst we're talking about that, Michael's on objective here. Mr. John Wick sneaking his way up. I mean, does Sophie know that Michael's on top of the objective? Is the question. Oh, the timing. I don't think she does. I mean, have you seen uh, Sophie's advanced position in here? A. Oh, throws out a nade. He's gonna go for it. Oh, he gets the swing he and he gets the kill. He gets the kill on objective. What Ooh. is going on? It is chaotic. That is what's going on. We've almost had yeah. two cap opportunities here. I'm getting sad. I want to see some caps. <laughs> Absolute and utter chaos. This has been a very close map. Jill could possibly bring back. And it would be down to a third map decider. That is a nice way. Yeah. They look very strong. Even though they uh, may not really know where they're going, they seem <laughs> to know how to play it, alright? <laughs> maybe just go back to spectating and leave your team to, to do the work and get you the win. <laughs> <laughs> then again, he did. Well, I say he used a, a syringe. He did shoot his teammate and then had to use the <laughs> syringe. So. Hey, 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 hey. We heard the whisper. You're still alive. <laughs> After he almost killed a teammate. Ah, uh, <laughs> class. Seeing the ramp up by newbies. We're going to see a hard slap by Special Boredom and Sophie here. This spawn does tailor. If you can get hold of the garage, then you're hop skipping a jump from a another cap. 
This is quite an aggressive fast push. One's going to be hearing this though, and they really got to be careful pushing out those doors. Oh, I get a feeling Michael might get exposed. Oh, taken out. At least I know Bottom. what spawn it is now. Bottom's on fire. Hopefully not. <laughs> Hopefully not literally in a few moments, but figuratively. Oh, early OC4. Out goes a smoke. Leandro is in a very bad position. Does need to rotate as soon as possible into a more safer location. Hey, hey, hey. Leander is the cheerleader of Schultz. He can die all he wants as long as it's spectacular. <laughs> oh, all my team kills button again, but oh my. Oh no. Mantis. Mantis. Mantis, part of the Marsoc team once again. <laughs> Why is he there? <laughs> oh no, Mantis! I I love I just I love the fact Button got flicked on by Leander <laughs> right before he died. Oh! I was about to say, there's no way we see a cap again. Okay, I can't handle the stress, Glue. On an empty stomach, I can't handle the stress. This is a. Uh... Just wow. <laughs> They're not the wrong team. Still rooting for Schultz here. I I think Shell can come it back. I think I believe in them. They can get it back. It's uh. <laughs> got... Oh, it's the North Garage objective, and it does tailor towards high cap opportunity. On camera two, you can cap exactly on those boxes. You don't even need to enter the objective room. You can also <laughs> cap from the backside. So, if Shell sneak Nat Tom in there once again, who knows what could happen? I love the fact that I uh, forgot to go into scoreboard. And I was just flying around the map again. We're <laughs> <laughs> uh, doing his mate, version of my dog Sumi's. Hey, ADHD <laughs> brain, ADHD. You don't even understand the amount of times that I've just been bouncing around subway or just around buildings. <laughs> it, it's it's so bad, and I get I get asked about it so often because there's just those sometimes where I forget to uh, go back to the scoreboard so people can't see it. But <laughs> <laughs> I like to I like to consider myself the new prospect of the drone racing league, but I know mouse and keyboard is is not allowed. So just fly yourself in between buildings. All right, now into the fifth round. So, if Shulk can push the middle and take control of the roof here, they have an immediate advantage. Also, they can shut down any push to the west, basically securing themselves the middle warehouse. Are they going to execute on that? It does not look likely. Button may be going for that. Sophie, no. Oh, wait. Okay, you can get up there now. So many things have changed, Glue. You're old, stop complaining. I am old. You're old and you Leander complain. Leander and Michael. Oh, out come here. on, Button. Button just needs to creep his way up. Sophie's got to be watching this, right? How do you, how do you predict someone being there? Oh! Please help. <laughs> Button on a please help scenario. Down goes Sophie. I, I think Sophie flashed themselves. Yeah, flashed Button <laughs> in an attempt. That is a attempt at survival. Look at this approach. I don't. Well, oh, I, just, I just saw north. What is this? 
the three Power Rangers over here creeping their way up through the north out of nowhere. Where did these guys come from? You're like they're walking directly into the newbie's claws here. Oh if, no. If they can get a kill onto Shot and Dead, that exposes. Who's that laser? Mantis. My long line. Come on, button. Peek your head. Mantis has got the right idea here. If he peeks around here, has a free approach relatively towards the objective. And this entry is about to commence. Knocks on fine special. Shrimp. Shrimp's not ready for two more here, though. Oh, that was a great flash. Does he know that two's there? And... <laughs> I love Mantis. the hand gestures. Newbies oh. distracted. This is exactly nice. what they wanted. Nice! Great refrag. Amazing refrag there. Down goes, oh, with a trade button, gets that second refrag. Down to a three versus one. Short on dead, last guy on objective. Did we see a there is here? a brick. Oh, the plane ring a ring a rosy, but Michael gets the last kill. The kill in the free free scoreline. I can't handle it, Glue. They're playing with my heartstrings. <laughs> Shult, take this to a map 3 decider. Please, I beg. There's been too many funny moments. Too many good moments for it to end now. I have to see it. Shult can win this. I believe in Shult. Complete. Complete the story. Right as the ending. I mean, they've got everything in their favour. A free free situation. But newbies have always prevailed in their Marsoc. Marsoc rounds, so... I reluctantly want to say Schultz take it. I I believe... Historically, newbies have performed better at Marsoc than Volk. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna sit quietly and have a little prayer. Braven, I believe in short to kind of get it back. <laughs> the beauty of Onward. The planning phase. Planning we'll phase. Just talk about whatever. Talk about the weather. How how how's the weather up there for you, Gray? In the north. Let yes. Me, let me have a peek. <laughs> let me have a look outside my window. Yeah. Let, let, let me have <laughs> let, a look let, outside the window. Let, let me also have a look outside my window. Yep, I can confirm it yeah, is pitch, pitch black. Not much to be comment on. Bleak as ever. The, the skies are dark. Just <laughs> like the life inside of me. Can confirm there is not much going on out, out there. We do see newbies get the... East spawn and no aggressive pushes from both teams here. Special Ops taking quickly the garage. And look at this hunkered down defense. Nocturne gonna run into Sophie if he's not careful. At least two. Need to go back to counting class, Nocturne. <laughs> Ready have two up in that center building on the roof. And this is where newbies do exceptionally well. In their fast approach to take round. I don't think that is penetrable, but a valiant effort special. I think he just thought it for a magic effect. Oh, a failed nade. Michael, you you uh, you scare me here. That could be a good angle though. Looking for the small gap. You're playing a risky business, Mantis, with this ninja of a position. Camera two. Oh, he fumbled that. Could have easily have had both there. Why didn't he go for short first? The guy to the left. Warden with another headshot. 
He's unstoppable. 11 and 3. I'm a headshot. Oh, Leander, you scare me. Oh, down goes Leander. 13 and 3. Boredom. Are you the newbies? Down goes Sophie. Next is one. Winnable if we can find Shot here. I mean, he's not got to worry about the cat, right? It's only true. Nice. I bored him. Come on. And he knows where the shot is. Come on. This. Come on. Nagged him for the clutch. Nagged him. Don't do it to me. Look at the discipline. <gasps> Please. I am. Begging you. Oh, no, no. The radio silent from both players. Nocturne's going to be listening for every piece of audio here. <sighs> he makes noise. Oh no, don't swing now. <laughs> My heartbeat is quickling. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. I'm not prepared for this, Gray. I mean, what do you do if you're knocked him? You don't have a good echo. Is he gonna peek this? If he peeks the top of this, he'll see shot. I don't think he's ready. And the over timing! No! Oh my. What? What are we watching? This is the most intense game of cat and mouse I've ever experienced in my entire life. The, the switch and baits and unintentional <laughs> mishaps <laughs> from both players. Noxum's gonna, Noxum's gonna see shot if he continues on this on this path. Noxum's hearing this also. Don't forget this util. And Noxum still. No. Did he no. He misses him. Did he? No. Yes. <laughs> 4-3! Bird map decider, baby! Shorter still in it! It's knocked him and bored him! A 10 and 3 and a 13 and 4. Wow! I was not, not prepared afraid. for that. I was not prepared for that. A map 3 decider. Knocked and clutches it on a 3v1. What are the chances? You can't oh run. You really is... can. <laughs> Against Oof. all odds, Nocturne finds one on the north and then plays a cat and mouse with Sharp for long. I think that was about a minute they were playing cat and mouse, just looking around each other. I, there was too many times to where that would have. <laughs> no, they should have clashed. It never and then happened. This is his initial shot. Misses his shot and oh then still finds a headshot. Oh my. Oh, the last I map. We are seeing a rehost here. I I was not prepared for this level of emotional investment for tonight. <laughs> I thought this car, I thought I said this would be a okay chill cast, they said. I was not expecting <laughs> to. Uh, have to one fix half my stuff and then two have the uh, emotional strain of going through this. <laughs> it's it's great for the the viewers. It's great for me. I'm having such <laughs> such a ball of a time casting these OG custom maps. Again, Hook has been around for forever in the original format and now. In the revised Hook 2.0 format for Quest, and we see the likes of Sand, which have gone through various iterations. It's great to see them come back to the competitive scene. Oh, wow, there is a lot of lobbies. <laughs> I'm just looking at all of these, uh, all the names on the containers. And Paintball for the Paintball. final map. Able for the final map. The this final is gonna be... countdown. Da -da -da -da. 
Dun, 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 dun. This is going to be interesting. I'm just kind of interested to see how this is going to go. From like, this is this is more favored towards the newbie's play style. So, will Schultz be able to kind of you know get off it? It's it will be very very difficult, I'd imagine. I'm just trying to think how will Schultz kind of get this back? They're more a slow paced team. You saw in those previous rounds on Sand, they were taking it a lot slower and strategically. Token those times to like creep up, get himself into a more favorable position before kind of pushing in. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's only two objectives, if I'm right in saying on this <laughs> on this map. So if we do see more than Oh yeah, you're right. There is a load of names. Global Chem, Beginners. Where's our Child name on there? The death. <laughs> Where's our name? <laughs> got Monochid. Who else have we got? Give some shout outs. Who else uh, do I know? Let's see. Got Blaze. Oh, there's even more. Phantom down. Operator. Phantom Operator. Where's 24 Grey? MK Snooper. <laughs> the Jill. Um, Aquafighter. Let's see here. We've got Resurgence on there. Peas. Wookie. Uh, Re. Chowie. Re. I don't know Playboy Nug. No. Rambo. Steve James. Army. Got Mayhem. Dark Tidings. I'm just, <laughs> we're just asked to read in now. Surprising because we, we normally okay. don't read very well. Boss fight, K Forts in the back. Oh, we need to ask where's Imperial? <laughs> where's my name? <laughs> Wait, I, I, I want to have my name on one of these containers to think about sometimes. I'm going to have to spit my dummy out. I will pay £2.50 to have Imperial or Infused Power's name written on it. I want my name. <laughs> what else is this? Uh, Stab's on here. <laughs> okay. Well, Grimtide, Heavens, GT Reaper, Animal House, Bacon Bits, L, Green. I'm not on here. I mean, no, I, I don't get, mean to be you, you, salty, you, you had you had to ask him. Oh. See your name on it oh. when he was making the map. Well, I'm a bit salty. You missed out, my friend. 24 Grey lives in your hearts, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> 24 Grey lives in my head. He's constantly shouting at me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm no way. I'm domestically no way. abused. I mean, Please, send least... help. Give a shout to Boss Fight, Global Chem, the beginners. All the teams better than us. Woods Five Free, who's recently come back to the league, joined, quote unquote, the best team, Imperial. Is that what you tell uh, yourself when you go to bed at night? That's <laughs> what I like to tell myself and my therapist. Is that what you tell your therapist? Uh, so I play yeah. for number one best onward team. Mm -hmm. Therapist like, mm hmm. So uh, onward, onward VML number one. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, when, I, I think when the therapist asked for your some of your accomplishments, I think they were asking for something a little bit more of high magnitude, to be honest, Gray. <laughs> yeah, I mean, unfortunately, this is kind of it. So, you get what you get. Hey. Well, there's you... some... They've taken a long time to uh, start this, haven't they? I would also take a long time to be totally honest with you, Glenn. I have no idea about this map. <sighs> I will sell my P is also on. I haven't seen him for a very long time. Not a true story. He actually did sell his P one time. What? Okay, can I get a camera? I'm stuck out of the map, Glenn. I am as well. <laughs> <laughs> camera one. Camera, camera one, one, camera one, camera one. 
No, we both got stuck up the map. I actually fallen out the map, and I'm now kind of stuck on the the top barrier. I wanna, please, may I come home, please? I wanna, I wanna see my family camera again. Camera one. Camera one. Camera one. Even Shush Leo's on here. Big shout out to Shush Leo. Ah, oh, we don't care about that nerd. It's not important. This is gonna be chaos, glue. Hey, and and as I see, and as I see, Shush Leo return for season sixteen. Doesn't matter to me. <laughs> You know, hear my prayers. Chaos. Hear my prayers. This is going to be mayhem. I'm too fixated on the the team names now. An early damage on set from Mantis sounds so good. Oh, Dango yeah, special. special. Dango's knacked them. Down goes bottom in button. They don't know it's a trade. Three Michael versus, three. versus Sophie. Oh, we're C4! No! What? Oh, just shot. Oh, that has to hurt. We had to fight shot. Mantis doesn't realize Sophie's behind them. Shrimp on objective. Sort of. Mantis crumbling now. Has to defend both angles. This is probably the best position I could hold. The only time in favor is Mantis. Oh. Beautiful from Mantis. Mantis. Come on, Mantis. Well Look, time, and a bit of skill. Shrimp is going for a pick underneath the container. I don't think the terrain is going to reward that, but... What? <laughs> what a good effort, nevertheless. This is one thing no other VR game's gotten right, in my opinion. The way that you can traverse the terrain, either proning, sprinting, crouching, you just have full 100% freedom of what you do with your player model. <laughs> Not in some aspects, but... Hey, I, <laughs> ironic that someone named you, Gray, mentioned something like that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you don't know what we were talking about earlier. So, Mantis should be able to see shrimp here. I think Mantis does have the upper hand. If he's looking the right way, the onward timing He's shooting the box! <gasps> no! Shrimp rotates off and Mantis is trapped. Oh my. He misses again! Please. Not a third time. Yeah, and he gets Mantis it! Finds the pick! Mantis oh. coming in clutch. Just hear his tears of pain and suffering. <laughs> yeah. It seems like Shul have a common trend here of missing the final shot, but at least pulling it out the gutter when they miss. <laughs> it, um, <laughs> close call multiple times and multiple rounds now, but they seem to pull it out the bag. Are they going to handle to do that again, though? That's kind of the question. Can Schultz keep it up? If Schultz win this, I will lose my mind. Like, absolutely lose my mind. <laughs> what I expect, fully expect, is the newbies are just going to hit the maximum aggression button and charge the middle, flashbangs, nades, C4s, Agree. and give us the newbie special. Just flash it. Just flash <laughs> it. I don't want to TM. Imperial that, motto. Imperial TM. Hey, tra hey, it. we're trademarking that. It's like how <laughs> N5 got the logo uh, trademarked and copyrighted. We're going to get just flash it. I will pay a lawyer yeah, no, to get no, that no, I think feed. About it, there's probably a lawsuit somewhere. <laughs> just do it. 
and just flash it. I think Nike would have something to say about that. But... <laughs> Anyway, I, I I don't know I don't I don't know I don't I don't think maybe trademarking just flash it is a is a good one. Yeah. <laughs> just in case later down the line. <laughs> Alright, and we're so... making our way into the second round. Down to A. Is this gonna be oh it's a five V five. Come on, short. Keeping it clean. Can they break all the odds? And it's all about these early lines. Special finds Michael. No refrag available. Shrimp in a powerful position here. Leander here in this audio cue, so. Shrimp misses him! He's already crossed. <laughs> Don't get too peaky, Shrimp. Knocked him! Ooh. Flash bang onto Mantis. Whoa, that's a shot. This is suddenly favoring Shull, in my opinion. Manis can find Sophie here, or at least a pick on special. Shoulder definitely in the danger zone here. Special. Just watching for that refrag on Sophie. Do we see the trademark C4 is the question. We do. Nice, gets one. 2v3, a special's not watching it. Man, I see him. It's a question. <laughs> Man, is. Oh, overexposes. Oh, and that flash is going to give your exact position away. I've seen miracles, but I've not seen a miracle like this. I mean, it's not some right? We saw it happen. We're going to see it happen again. Shot. Not watching that line. I don't think can be seen from that position. No, it can. There's a massive gap in the box. Pallet. Box pallet. It happened now. That's kind of the question. I think Nagtum sees him. Timing. If Nagtum holds this. He can see through the box, I believe. I don't believe so. I think. He worries. POV. Saying. If he peeks his head. Just slightly. And specials on the rotate here. Oh. That flash is going to catch him. Borden's not watching the refrag. Oh. Yeah. That was such a suicide flashbang play. That's the issues with flashes, right? You know that it's the last person. So the moment you let that flash go, any audio cues is communicated if you're flashed or not. And it, it, it really tailors towards <laughs> the vault just honing in on your position. We do see a different objective spawn though. This is totally new to me, Glue. So I'm... You say this as if I played this map before. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's me. I, I don't play custom maps very much. I, I stick to my uh my official maps. It's like it's like it's like a required taste for customs. You must be able to cap in this container, right? 
Oh, uh, that's one. You must. I realise I didn't go to scoreboard again. I've been flying around the map. <laughs> <laughs> the ADHD. Everyone knows about it now. People are like, oh my, it's confused with ADHD again, trying to bounce off all the walls. <laughs> Yeah, to get do we see a turn. cap by newbies or do we see a another vault win by Shaw? <laughs> Ooh, look at those lines and the shots are coming out already. Quite an aggressive defense by Schultz here. Oh, Mantis. Mantis! Oh, Mantis, you're scaring me here. How aggressive you're playing. Nice! Stan goes one by Nactum. Mantis is still pushing up. Mantis, how much space do you want? Get Sophie! Stand up his tippy toes! It's working. Stan goes button. Oh, oh, overexposed himself, gets taken out. I think, yeah, sure heard Nactum. That goes a flash. That should that flash should really wear off. Oh, gets one. I killed another one. So, hmm? and a nade. Oh, the nade. Dango special ops. Dango gets. Could he get the refrag from? The, he's in a very good position now for this. Who's using the shotgun? Michael's out <laughs> using the shotgun, just spraying the Spaz 12. Leander, you know where the last guy is. It should be a isolate and execute. The more boredom takes the back of Schultz here, the more dangerous it becomes. You're not going to expect Borden to... Okay. Leander! Leander! Borden's going to push on that. Leander, this is almost the the third time this game you've almost <laughs> murdered a friendly in cold blood. It's almost but, uh, like it's almost like he wants to murder his teammates. You know what I mean? I was about to say there's a team called Friendly Fire for that, but I mean, hey, they lost one. Of, hey, they lost. <laughs> they they lost one of their best uh, Friendly Fire members. who killed the. <laughs> he had the most uh, team kills on the team. <laughs> we just have to watch out. Now. Oh, the under. The under's not going to be ready for this. Down to the onward timing. Leander sees him! Oh! Headshot by Leander. Keeping it clean. 2 1. Short could still win this. Timing, timing, timing. I'll be so surprised if this goes out in the way it's looking like. So, what do you think, Gray? Who, who's your votes for? Who are you begging for? Honestly. Team Schultz or way, Team Newbies? Well, the way Schultz have held their defense is even if they do take it to the final round, they have Volk advantage. So I reckon Schultz take it. Let's see if there's another spawn or another spawn, another objective. <laughs> because I'm pretty certain there's only two on this map so we may see a repeat but overall Schult are looking quite quite good against newbies in my opinion I wonder how many people are currently sat in the, the stream you've just heard about seven discord pings and they're just <laughs> and they're just reaching for their discord to see that they're actually not important and no one's messaged them Hey, everyone's important. <laughs> Don't worry. Uh, I'm I a mean, bit harsh. If, everyone's, if you're everyone's all important, important, then it means you're not important. Because, so... 
If you're making it worse. You're important. <laughs> <laughs> uh, everyone's important and wonderful in their own ways. My way is just thinking about laying in bed and closing my eyes and just reaching for the bottle of vodka beside my bedside. <laughs> Oh, Dot takes out Nactum, but Bun gets out Refug, and more shots coming out. This map is just who can pre fire the hardest, to be honest. Oh, oh, the nade too short. Great nade, though. Down goes Michael. Mental free? I get the feeling it's going to be Vulk trades. Because yeah, Shola not out of it yet. Leander may find special. He is no longer uh, gonna find I special. <laughs> yep, I bet you do oh. take that back. Oh! Just board him. Stop it with the one taps. Oh my gosh. So next time we play newbies, just remember to put an extra helmet on <laughs> against boredom. Make sure I buy a cheap helmet after the next round. <laughs> <laughs> Full by every single round. <laughs> Full by Rush Beast. Did I just get DM'd by someone else? Okay. The CSGO law is impeccable. Oh. I traded. I feel oh like Boredom just has his controllers automatically aim at people's heads. Oh well. I want what he's having, Glue. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is another vault trade. Can newbies close it out in two? I'm just thinking. Cause I am one. The, the, We're back to the original objective. Can Short oh, if if Short if Short gets this Volk round, Noobies will get the uh, the Marsock round. It, it's just gonna be trade after trade. Well, there's only two objectives, right? So Short defended this one <laughs> successfully the first time. If they can He's defend the next down. round, then Short could take this home. Unless well, short come out of nowhere and they win next round, but I don't know. It's uh, I'm seeing a pattern here. What's Schultz's weakness here? I think um, aggression. If hmm. they get a lot of smokes onto objective and send one of their fast caps in, it's over. I don't want it to be over, but it's over. It's never over till it's over. <laughs> and we are moving in. Can Short keep it out? Get that final defensive round in? Or will newbies take it out of their hands? Well, if Leander stops looking at the TV screen behind him, maybe perhaps there'll be a higher chance of them winning this. <laughs> I love the I love the fact I keep seeing Nactum bubble up and down as he jumps on his tippy toes. <laughs> okay, special. Um What a need. 
Beautiful nade coming out there. Down goes one. Could possibly get a second. Sorry, I'm, I'm just... Come on, Nactum. Yeah. I was just trying to spy special... Oh, well, Nactum with the double kill! What? Okay, Shelt. I told you, the defensive rounds, they're powerful. Now, Schultz, break, break the curse and take <laughs> final map. To pro for, to uh, pro for to 101 in chat. I'm going to get every single clip from me, Gray's part and put them all together of Leander almost team killing. <laughs> Don't you worry, that will be coming soon, straight to you <laughs> on oh, VHS. God, I, I will send you a VHS to your address of all of those clips. How's that sound? <laughs> and on that VHS, there will be a, just a YouTube link. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Shell. Close it out. I don't mean to say this as I've got food downstairs, but... <laughs> So you want I food, believe huh? You. I believe in you. <laughs> I 115% believe in you, Schultz. Also, I do like the advertisements. I mean, bearing we're on VRML, I probably shouldn't read most of them out, but just to draw a highlight to the great work by Beluga, is that right? Beluga, 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 Beluga. I don't, know. I don't even know if Beluga created the 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 map. <laughs> I, I'm under the assumption it was Beluga. If not, I terribly apologise. Hey, there's a lot of really great maps out there by a lot of you know well mappers and Belgos, uh, especially one of them. He is one of the goats. Oh, oh, Maxon just misses those early lines. Out goes short. Leander, look at Leander. He's going for it. Leander has snuck in here. This is dangerous. No one's watching objective. No, no way, no way. Leander! It's Leander! No! It's all crumbling! No! Chaos! I was about to offer Leander a spot on Imperial. <laughs> that was about to happen. It's all falling apart. Oh. Oh. That hurts emotionally. So, Noctum, can you do the impossible? We've been here before. Knocked him in the exact same position. The newbies doing the exact same defense. They've just had a drop. A 3v1 now. I still don't think that's going to be enough though. We were in this exact position to three rounds ago, four rounds ago. Sharp playing his pallet position, special ops in the north. I believe it was selfie on objective, but still. And he doesn't need a cap here. All he needs is free kills. Oh. And finds his toes. Three. 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 
We are this back is, to the tiebreaker. This is the tiebreaker, ladies and gentlemen. Everything which has led up to this point is now up to this last round. Oh my. One hour and 38 minutes. All down to one round of five minutes. This, is, this has been a two hour long cast. straight into it. Oh. No? No. Don't tease me like that. Don't tease me like that, guys. Well, ladies and gentlemen, take your bets right now. Who will be winning? <laughs> I accept PayPal bets. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot promise Red you'll ever get them back, but I'm just telling you, I'm, I'm just establishing Red. that you can...